In the last few hours, lawyers for Fulton County District Attorney Fani Willis and Special Prosecutor Nathan Wade were in court trying to block subpoenas that would require them to testify at a hearing later this week. Now, during that hearing, a judge will evaluate a motion seeking to disqualify the pair from prosecuting the ongoing Trump Rico case. Investigative reporter Zach Merchant has been tracking this story for weeks now. He joins us live in the studio with the latest. Zach. Guys, the big takeaway today, despite D.A. Willis asking the judge to cancel that hearing, Judge Scott McAfee said it will proceed as scheduled. It's the latest development in the ongoing controversy in the case after one of Trump's co-defendants, Michael Roman, filed a motion seeking to kick Willis and Wade off of the case, accusing the pair of having an improper romantic relationship. Earlier this month, Willis and Wade admitted they had a relationship, but Willis denied benefiting from it. Willis asked the court to cancel the disqualification hearing and just rule on the motions, but today, Judge Scott McAfee said Thursday's hearing will happen. The state has admitted a relationship existed, and so what remains to be proven is the existence and extent of any financial benefit, again, if there, has, if there even was one. Judge McAfee scheduled time on Thursday and Friday for the hearing and also left open the possibility it could last even longer. The judge did block the subpoena of Nathan Wade's bank records today, but so far he has not yet definitively ruled on whether Willis and Wade will have to testify.